Hey everybody, it's Peter here with GoodyReader.com. Today we're going to look at how to use Siri and we're using an iPad mini. So usually what you do is press and hold the home button, but when you do that, nothing happens. We've had a lot of problems uh, with that, so what you'd want to do is go to Settings, General, Siri, and make sure it's on, and then click Enable. You can choose Languages, uh, voice feedback, my info, you can go ahead and change any of those settings. We'll just keep it on English United States for now. So what you can do from there is ask Siri to uh, open applications, web searches, ask it questions, and so much more. We're going to start with uh, application. Kindle. And it opens Kindle right away, which is the Kindle app on our device. Next we're going to do a Google search. Google.com. Like French fries. Searching Google for French fries. And it'll instantly open up Google and away you go with your full search. And last thing, you can just kind of mess around and do things like Siri, tell me a joke. So, not the funniest of jokes, but uh, you can use it for things like that and just ask it questions and so forth. So, um, this has just been a, a brief tutorial on how to use Siri on the iPad Mini. Remember, if you're ever uh, locked out of using Siri, when you press and hold the home button and nothing happens, go into Settings, General, Siri, and then you can enable or disable Siri along with changing uh, different languages to uh, many other languages. So. There you have it. For uh, other videos, you can visit our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash goodyreader. And um, you can go to goodyreader.com slash blog for all the latest reviews, interviews, and so much more e-reader, tablet, and digital publishing related. And for Goody Reader, this is Peter.